A Cubano is an iconic Cuban food truck sandwich prepared with roast pork and ham between layers of cheese and pickles. It is a perfect meal on the go. Cooking Company will take you step by step into preparing an ultimate Cuban sandwich at home. Just like that. I hope you're ready. Start by adding two teaspoons of yeast to 200 milliliters of warm water. Then in another bowl, mix 200 grams of flour, one teaspoon of salt and two teaspoons of sugar. Then pour in your yeast water and use your hands to knead everything together. This is messy and might take a while, but stick with it. Sprinkle flour on a board, then roll out your bread dough until it's smooth and even. Pour two tablespoons of olive oil into a bowl and coat the sides. Pop your dough inside, seal it up with cling film, and let that sit for one hour. Then remove the film and take the dough back to a floured board. Roll it out into a long sausage-like shape. Place the dough on a lined baking tin, Sprinkle with some more flour and cover with cloth and allow to sit for 30 minutes. Remove the cloth and use a sharp knife to score the bread dough at regular intervals. Dust with more flour. Then it's time to bake at 200 degrees for 20 minutes. While it's baking, mix two tablespoons of garlic, one tablespoon of pepper, salt and cumin, and two tablespoons of oregano in a small bowl. Then add 100 milliliters of lime juice and orange juice, and two tablespoons of lime zest and stir together well. Add three tablespoons of thyme and rosemary and three bay leaves and stir again. Now, add a few good sized chunks of pork to your marinade. Cover it up with cling film and allow it to sit for two hours. Then it's time to bake at 150 degrees for four hours. Wow, look at it go. Take your freshly baked baguette and carefully trim off both ends of the bread. First one, and then the other. Once you've done that, cut it into two smaller pieces. Turn the half onto its end and carefully cut down the center so that you have two even sides for your sandwich. Using a really sharp bread knife will make this part much easier. Now coat both sides of your bread with plenty of butter. Once they're coated, fry them, butter side down, for several minutes. Keep cooking until the bread turns golden brown, like so. Remove them from the pan and spread on plenty of your favorite mustard. Lay out some pickled cucumber, plenty of ham, and of course a generous portion of your cooked pork. Mm -mm. Add your favorite cheese, and then of course the remaining half of your baguette. Butter your pan again, and sit your sandwich inside. Press down on the sandwich with something heavy to help everything cook. Brush some more butter on top, and then turn the sandwich over. Easy does it. Keep cooking for a few more minutes, pressing down all the while. When it's done, it's time to remove from the pan and slice up your sandwich. 
I've gone for a diagonal cut. Time to serve up and impress your loved ones with a homemade Cubano. Enjoy!